Continuation of 2327 Clayton Hoff, October 20th, 2017. Um, my camera got cut off, so here's the kitchen. I can get the stove. Um, all the light bulbs work in here. They're not matching, but they do work. So here is underneath. Let's see. In the oven, the oven looks super clean. And this is obviously like it's newer for sure. Where this, huh, one of the okay, so all those work, but one of the the front left or the front right, excuse me, the left side front one is not working. Okay, top of the fridge, yeah, and inside the fridge, it's dirty still a little bit. area looks good the floors look good in here the only thing like I said I noticed is this wall with a few little scuff marks and scrapes the back door looks fine um it could have used like well there's some bugs and stuff on it it doesn't look horrible but I'm going into like the study area so the ceiling fan doesn't have a light um, near the right side of the door, there's like a, an evident little white area that looks like the paint was kind of peeled off. So to the as you enter this little study, I guess first bedroom with the French doors on the left side, there is some um, paint area like it was obviously scuffed up or something was scratched it. Underneath the window, there is another area that has like paint that was kind of damaged. I don't know if at one point there was a light in here or what, but um, it has a switch for it, so I'm confused. This outlet cover, the cable outlet cover is um, really loose. Nothing in the cabinet. The French doors look good, the locks are good. We may need to put I can't see that smoke detector blinking. Okay. We'll have Reiki check them. Hallway looks good. There's a little scuff mark on the right hand side. Closet looks fine. Here's the master. So I do have some um, Clorox wipes in the car. There's a little bit of dog hair and some like little areas that are that need to be wiped off. I could not get this light in here to turn on in the master bedroom. Um, luckily, the tenant did leave some light bulbs that were here from the previous tenant. So I'll go ahead and double check that. Um, also, the ceiling, it appears to have some water damage. Um, as you enter the bedroom on the left, there's like a few areas like where pictures were hung that we could have, um, I don't know if you'd consider that normal wear and tear, but maybe it was the person before. And then above the um, curtain rods, it looks like there was like smaller curtains hung at one point. The only other place would be on the right wall on the bottom. Um, I don't know if that's like scuff marks from a dresser, but it's, it's a pretty, not big area, but big enough. Screen door looks nice and clean. The light out here does not work, so we need to charge her for that. I'm going to try to remove or like install a light bulb or coordinate with the tenants and have that. Um, there is this, this mirror that has like fingerprints on it. In the closet looks fine. Flooring looks good. There's a little scraper. I don't know if that's a scraper. Okay, no, it's just dirt. It looks good in here. Um, same thing, there's like some handprints on the mirror. Nothing in the drawers.
So the, the doors are good. Um, the back of the door looks perfect. Here is the master bathroom. Um, there's a few little areas like that are dirty on the front of the cabinets, but nothing huge. You can see that there's like little hairs in here. I'll wipe that up. And there's hair in here too. So lights, the mirror could use another little wipe down. Like there's some water spots and stuff. I think they're overall are pretty clean. Here is the towel bars. Towel bars look good. They have a little bit of dust on them too. Ceiling is fine. This tub looks a little dirty. I don't know if that was like from it, like if that's how it was previously or what, it's insane, but it definitely looks a little dirty. Here's the tile. The tile's all right. Pants. Okay, so I'm not sure. Maybe this is the bathroom that the tiles were damaged, possibly. Um, the toilet, I would not say that it's that clean. Yeah, the toilet does need to be. There's like stuff inside. And then, uh, um, little bits of hair. Okay, the door needs to be wiped off. Okay, so nothing in here. Alrighty. In the hallway, um, before that there was a door stopper, there is like a, a scuff mark in the wall, like a hole in the wall. Here is the main bathroom, same type of thing, the mirror is a little weathered. There's a little bit of hair and some like dirt in here. And same thing, the closet, there's a little um, drawer has some stuff in it. Shower head's good. Tiles of pine. The front of this needs to be wiped off a little bit. Okay, toilet. Uh, the toilet does have like a regular. Okay. Well, just kind of slow. You can see a little rain. Uh, it needs to be wiped out. Here's the tile. The tile looks good. This drawer is alright. The dust and stuff that's kind of in there and there's more hair. Hot water's good. The walls look fine in here. Um, same thing, there's like a watermark on the top of the ceiling. Doors, mm, the back of the door, let me get this quick. Has some areas that have like need to be cleaned. And here's the last bedroom closest to the garage. Walls in here look good. Light and ceiling fan. Let's see. Light work, ceiling fans work. There's a few little nail holes um, on the wall, but nothing major. Overall, in here looks really good. It's more so just like cleaning the toilets, dusting a few of the um, for tops of the countertops and the toilet seat, and cleaning the toilet a little bit, cleaning a few of the mirrors. But other than that, before moving, so um, in the flooring, there's a few little gaps on the floor. Um, but overall, everything looks pretty pretty good. Um, here's the big window. There's some dust and stuff. But the blinds are good, the window's good. There's the garage, and then the outside, and we're good. So here is 
the garage. There's some tools. There's some dusters. Um, I'll check the garage doors in a second. It's a little dusty out here. There's like some bird seed. This, I know this was leaking at one point, but um, there's a few items like a vacuum, a lamp, um, coat hanger. There's some potting soil, ladder, um, tile for the bathroom and the kitchen. There's some racks, uh, some Drano, a hose, some, uh, again, gardening tools and some paint a lock okay so there's only one garage door that opens manually or one's manual the other one's just garage door okay, okay perfect light works light works looks good and it's just the flooring there's a few little scuff marks on the door. Okay, so locks are good. Backyard, let's see. Okay, this lock must be on. So there's some flowers, um, a few little tables, some green chairs. The lawn looks perfect. Fence looks all right. There we have it, it's wet. Okay. This looks good. Let's secure this lock a little bit. So the front of the property. My shoes on. There's the front. A little bench. Front of the property. The stairs look good. Plants and um, lawn was mowed. All right. So the only other thing would be the right side. There's a hose. Flower beds look okay. Yeah, it looks great. All right. 